All right, um, here's one of the ways I compost at our home. It is a compost tumbler. This one's pretty nice. Um, the one that makes it special is this handle. So I can just kind of set it. It's kind of short. Um, I can use this to turn, and, um, s turn the compost. Compost has to be turned um, pretty consistently for it to be um, to, for it to break down evenly. And I'm using this with the gears in there makes it a whole lot easier because on the other option is to use your hands on oh my gosh, see like that's a lot more effort to spin like this as opposed to just the hand. So this unit is pretty great. It has this hand. This is by Maze, M-A-Z-E. I really dig this brand. It's not um um it's kind of expensive, but it's a really nice unit. It's 65 gallons. It's two compartments. This compartment's been going longer. This one is the one I'm going to harvest. This one, um, there's still a lot of identifiable, identifiable stuff, and I've more recently been adding to the side. So today I'm going to harvest this, and I'm going to filter, um, sift it. There's a lot of stuff in here. Like it looks like some paper didn't break down all the way. So I'm going to put this kind of stuff into this side, and get out the usable stuff because my garden is ready in a transition i'm going to have a lot of stuff that's going to be breaking down and needing to be composted so i need space so i'm going to harvest some of this i'm going to get this one moving faster and make space for, for more compost let's do it all right so i'm able to just um keep the lids on spin it upside down and then i open the lid and that's how i harvest to help expedite it. See now it's nice and empty. I've got two big buckets of nice finished compost, but I am still gonna um, sift this. I do want it to be consistent, and I'm just gonna put back in what doesn't break down. Oh, see, like this kind of stuff gets into balls, and then it just doesn't break down properly. Like this kind of stuff can get ran a second time. All right, this is where I'm going to finish it at. I have my two containers of compost. I have my wheelbarrow. And then I have this uh, sifter I just made here with just cheapo, like Douglas fir 2x4s and half inch galvanized um, hardware cloth. I tailor made it to the size of my wheelbarrow. So I'm just going to dump that right on the here and sift it right into the wheelbarrow. so I can avoid the sun. So, um, popsicle sticks. I don't mind that being in the compost, but that can get ran again. Paper, I'm gonna rerun this kind of stuff. Bigger sticks, that kind of stuff. These eggshells didn't get broken down.
All right, sifting is done. This looks pretty dope. This looks really, really nice. I have to go find a bucket to put this in or somewhere nice to put this in so it doesn't totally dry out. Very nice consistency compost. <sighs> Smells good. No rotten smell at all. Bunch of it out of that one load. Pretty dope. Super excited. <laughs>